Hey, howdy, y'all. How's it going? Welcome back. This album uh, seems like something I'm going to love because, hang, hang on, let me pull up the the DM from Marius that you sent me. For some context, this is a more poppy record, but it is a very unique sound. They used to be a progressive metal slash prog rock band, but with unseen color, they shifted more towards progressive pop slash alt rock. A lot of uplifting vibes, huge choruses, fantastic clean vocals, and intricate drum work. They also happen to be a local band to me, which is super fun, as they're one of my favorites. I've never seen anyone react to any of their songs, so this should be fun. Not as progressive or unique as a lot of Agent Fresco tracks, that's the other one he recommended to me, or he requested that I listen to. Not as progressive or unique as a lot of Agent Fresco's tracks, but it's still up there in my opinion. Melody Mayhem. This seems like it should be right up my alley. Again, I don't know anything about this band or what I'm in for, but I'm just excited to hear it. Also, I have my coke slushy uh, icy from Meyer that I'll be sipping on throughout. <laughs> Ooh, vocal harmony. Something for the world to revolve around. That's a beautiful melody, yes. Yes, let's go. Let me find some comfort in the cold unknown. I know this is sound. Let me find some comfort in the cold unknown. That's such a good melody. Okay. I don't want to pause throughout this entire thing, but this is amazing. Cannot be found. Let's go. World to revolve around. That's so good. Oh, this guy's falsetto is so beautiful. Ooh. Little hints of EDM influence. Just a wee bit. Not to compare them to Coldplay because they're very different sounding than Coldplay, but I'm just going to compare them a little bit to Coldplay because Coldplay is my favorite pop group. But they're similar to Coldplay in that, like, you know, the song structure is pretty simple. And then the melodies are just really good. There's nothing too crazy with the song structure, but there's like elements and atmosphere of really good melody and just things that just they keep you in the song and they grip you. And like the, the little synth stuff towards the end was really good. And the the different melodies like the da 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 I forgot the words for that exactly. If I can start singing along to a song halfway through, that's how you know it. it's got a good melody. I know what it means, so don't get excited. Change it all you want, change the goal, change it as you go. Give it all you got, give yourself everything. Now it goes on and on and on. Whatever I will try to spoil the fun. This is so catchy. Ooh. Ooh, we're speeding up. It's like an like an arena arena chorus type thing. This drumming is so good. Why does this sound like Fallout Boy or something? Another good track. Oh. More lyrics not synced. Come on, music smash people, get on this. I'm kind of addicted to Coke Ice, he's not gonna lie. Oh. Alright, I'm like peeking the mic, I need to stop. It's probably a millisecond off on the video too, so it's probably gonna annoy you. This is a solid banger album. So far, two and a half tracks in. I see I had to check if I was two and a half tracks in because I have short-term memory loss or something, right? Oh no! I lost the... I lost where we were. <laughs> it's fine, I'll find it, I'll find it. It's okay. Oh, come on. Go 
All right. <laughs> I expected it to come in earlier than it did. For Ooh, yeah, melody switch out. Beautiful. Yeah, three tracks in. This is really good. Uh, it it isn't. It's not one of those albums that's like blowing me away, but I'm just kind of vibing. I'm like, yeah, this is, these are some good songs. It's not like Agent Fresco where I was like literally losing my mind at how unbelievable it was, but this is really good still. It's just, it's feel good music. That's what it is. It's not, it's not really something that's like super prog or super technical or there's a deep meaning to it or it has a big story. It's just, just a solid pop rock album so far, at least. Maybe it'll take a nosedive and I'll hate it. I don't know. It's that Donald Trump dance. You know that one? Where he does this thing. <laughs> Whoa. Some different chords in here. Nice. Very solid. See, it's very vibey. This part reminds me of Tron. I don't know much to say. It's just... Just solid. Ooh. Oh, okay. Alright. That sounded like that one meme sound, you know, the... If you know, you know. Cool. Cool song. Oh, I like this. good the last few songs i were kind of i was kind of more mixed on but this one i really do like this is very vibey definitely one of my favorite songs so far some funky bass yeah it's definitely one of the better tracks so far that's a good one okay well there's no lyrics for this one that's cool Too deep and I don't have the lyrics. It's those fifth jumps that I love. But um but um but um What made you believe this life is what you wanted? Alright, this one's getting a little repetitive. Again, no lyrics. What is up with this? Good piano. Ooh. This song is already way proggier than some of the other tracks have been. The other ones are more poppy. This one feels like it's developing more. Ooh, 
strings. This is like one prog track on a pop album. It's like Coldplay's latest album. Ah, no! I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hit play. I just meant to hit it and then the play button popped up. No, I'm so sorry. Anyway, while I'm here, Coloratura is a masterpiece and you guys need to listen to it. I'm going to do a video just dedicated to Coloratura at this point. It's, it's so good. It's the best song that Coldplay's ever written. In my opinion. No lyrics for this one either. Are you kidding me? Why can't they put lyrics in these? Oh, that picked up real quick. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. I'm not sure how I feel about that, actually. I didn't hate it. There were some tracks I, I really enjoyed. Um, the first three tracks were really good. Now, there were some tracks. The last two tracks were, were interesting, but a lot of the middle tracks... I just don't really remember all that much. And that's kind of what I've said is my measure of if I really liked an album or not. 